right, John here at the Century Arms Canic booth with Chad. Uh, let me tell you guys, this kind of took me surprise. Uh, TTI Canic. Uh, not that it's not a deserving gun, but this is. Hey, how you guys doing? So, welcome to That's the range I'm thinking about. Yeah. I feel like it's Friday already. We're introducing a Mechanic TTI Combat, uh, which is the newest offering for Mechanic. It's a whole uh, a brand new frame mechanic, so this is not based off of an existing frame. It does come with the aluminum back wall, it comes with the uh, back strap so you can custom fit it to your grip. It's got a double undercut a trigger guard, so you get a really nice purchase on the pistol. And it has this awesome Karen texturing all the way around. Again, really great purchase on the pistol. Uh, it doesn't go anywhere in your recoil. Uh, you'll notice the uh, slide stops are extended, and they're also uh, serrated uh, to match the, uh, the slide itself. It is optics ready. Highly recommend putting one of our mechanic MO, uh, MO3s on there. Fantastic optic. It's nice on there. It comes with a blacked out rear sight. You've got a fiber optic front sight for a really quick target acquisition. Great side alignment. Uh, you'll see it notes it's got uh, front and uh, rear serrations uh, for all you really cool tactical guys. You might can grab it from the front, do a press check. There's a pick rail on the bottom there for accessories. Always put a light on your gun and identify your target. And the coolest thing about this is the uh, pump. So it's got a pointed barrel, and this pump is a first uh, for cannons. It's a quick disconnect pump system, so it's not a threaded barrel, and uh, it pops off. Uh, pops off nice and easy, so uh, when you're cleaning it, it's not a pain to, to get in there, get the barrel clean, get the pump clean. I should also mention that the barrel is fluted. It's really awesome fluting here. Style points. It uh, comes right out of the box with a three and a half pound trigger that breaks at 90 degrees. We can go ahead and demonstrate that. Really nice, positive wall. Crisp break and a great reset. It comes with two magazines. This one here is the 18 round magazine with the Terran uh, base pad. It's a plus four base pad, so you get base pad, so you get 22 rounds in this magazine. And it comes with a flush fit 18 round magazine as well. MSRP on this pistol. That is uh, awfully tempting. It's great. So if anybody uh, watching knows anything about TTI pistols and collaborations, uh, generally uh, Terrence pistols are pretty heavy, uh, 2500 all the way up to 4 grand. So you want to keep this one uh, super affordable for anybody wanting to get, 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 get into a Terrence tactical pistol and get out to the range and uh, maybe do some competition. You can certainly carry this pistol, uh, add a light to it, add an optic to it, and uh, get out there and protect yourself and enjoy that second of your Awesome, man. Appreciate you, Chad. Thank you. All right. We're going to work our way around the booth a little bit, take a look at some of their product offerings. Now, a lot of these are not new products, but they're still worth mentioning. Uh, this is one I've been interested in for a while. Always, uh, as you've probably seen some of my other videos, I'm kind of looking at these uh, micro compact, subcompact size 9 millimeters. Uh, it gets a little warm in Florida, so this to me would be a great carry option. I've got so used to shooting with an optic that optic ready is important to me. So this is definitely a contender. Gun I enjoy the trigger on. Multiple color choices, different options available. Like I said, optics ready. This one, I believe, is featuring the Canic Mechanic, which is Canic's in-house optic. Can't go wrong with classic all black, and I'll tell you what, the pretty nice, uh, strong reticle there. Especially if you've got uh, some aging eyes like mine. Moving on, the guns get bigger and more feature-packed. Optics Ready TP9 SFX. This is a pretty slick gun. I'm not 100% sure of I mean, this. may be a uh, distributor exclusive, but uh, threaded barrel. Interesting. Uh, imagine this uh, 
The bell hood feature there is maybe the clear debris, uh, or maybe just add a little bit of bling, but either way, it actually looks kind of smart. Nice weight to it, nice balance. Of course, it's not loaded, but nice feeling gun. We got the meat SFT, similar gun. Like those flat triggers. Ah, get it in uh, different color options. A little less uh, feature packed than the one next to it, but basically the same platform. And we're going to move around as far as we can here. ESFX. Nice full size, uh, you know, like tactical size. Again, nice feel, nice weight to it. More of a compact size. I like it. I like the uh, Magwell flare on it. Gonna hop around here. Another neat SFT battle worn uh, distressed look. Same deal, but in uh, more of an OD green. Right, continue around. It's another one that's interested me. TP9 Elite, I would say it's probably a little bit smaller than a Glock 19. Optics ready. Again, this one looks to be wearing their mechanic, mechanic in house optic. I like how it's serrated, the slide serrations, match the serrations on the optic. You got their rival. All the sites that split up sites that just put on the CAA ones. Then Century Arms has all kinds of fun stuff. That, of course, I would not buy nothing. Especially something in the uh, MP5 size. Some more awesome stuff in the MP5 flavor. Offered by Century Arms. Pretty cool. If you don't want to get a stamp, so I think I prefer the stamp size one. <laughs> 